The discussions Barrister Ovenseo Tame Chave Ebi Tamans and Bishop Usadolo Che had diverse views on whether or not the army should be deployed during the rerun elections in River State. Barrister Ovenseo Tame pointed out that the deployment of the military for the rerun elections became necessary against the backdrop of the volatile situation in River State citing series of politically motivated killings. Chief A.B. Thomas, however, ruled out the deployment of the military for the election. Chief A.B. Thomas rather advocated the need to equip and empower the police, which he noted can ensure adequate security before, during and after the rerun elections. On his part, Bishop Osadolo Uche conversed that what is of paramount importance is fairness and justice and urged INEC to live up to its responsibility in ensuring credible and acceptable elections. A civil rights activist, Jane Usaige, expressed concern that women are not given equal opportunity to participate in politics even though more women are enlightened and intellectually equipped to aspire to any political office. We are practicing a true federalism. Because we are practicing true federalism, every party wants to be at the power, at the seat of power in America. There should be a kind of decency in the management of the political crisis between these two gentlemen who have at least attained such status of governor and ex-governor. One will expect for fairness for justice, for equity, for transparency, that Arnett should look into these allegations, whether they are true or not. We will continue to be equal that we are different. No woman wants to be a man, there is joy in being a woman. But I want to contribute, like I said before, Nigeria cannot fly. If the Nigerian airways or any of the planes has only one wing, it cannot leave the ground. And that is why we are not developing. Colors like Bishop Iso from Sabugida Ora and Sonny from Benin contributed to the program through phone calls. Politics Today is aired the same time on ITV Radio every Saturday from 10.30 to 11.30 in the morning. Deborah Ubefun reports in.